Welcome back to our channel. This is Melanie from Polkadots and PixieDust.com and today we are chatting all about Mirrors Transportation from Orlando International Airport to Disney Resort Hotels. Let's check it out! Travelers who are flying into Orlando International Airport have several options when it comes to getting from the airport to their Disney hotel. Uber or Lyft, a taxi, private transportation, and Mirror Shuttle are all available to take you to your resort. If you're familiar with Disney's previous shuttle transportation, the Magical Express, Mirrors actually is the same exact company Disney used, but now it's no longer free. Let's take a look at how the service works. If you're flying into Terminal A or B, you'll arrive at MCO and board the airport tram. This is a quick two minute ride to get to the other side of the airport. If you're arriving at a Terminal C, You'll just go down to level 1 after collecting your luggage and you'll head to the Mirrors Welcome Center. The rest of the airport information in this video is for Terminal A and B travelers. And if you're anything like me, you'll get distracted by the Disney Store on this side of the airport for your very first dose of Disney Magic. Then you can either take the elevator or go down the first set of escalators to baggage claim. After getting your luggage or skipping this part if you didn't check anything, you'll take the elevator or the next set of escalators down one more floor, and once you've reached this level, you'll see a sign for Mirrors Transportation. Follow the sign and you'll go down a long hallway to check in. Be sure to have your boarding pass out and ready to be scanned. This will have been sent to your email when you booked the trip, and after you've been scanned, you'll be sent to a certain line based on your destination. You'll then wait at that line until you're called and your motor coach is ready for you. They'll store your luggage during the journey, so you can sit back and relax. The bus is pretty comfortable, the seats have footrest, and there's even a restroom in the back on board. It can take anywhere from 45 minutes to over 2 hours to get to your resort depending on how long you have to wait for others at the airport and what stop you are on the route. You'll be dropped off directly in front of your resort, making it easy to start your vacation. The day before you leave Disney, you'll get an email with your pickup time and your departure boarding pass. When it's time to get picked up, you'll head to this sign and wait for your bus to arrive. If you don't see it, just ask a cast member at your resort and they'll help you find it. Sometimes Mirrors doesn't have enough passengers to fill a bus during slower periods, so instead they'll pick you up in a smaller shuttle. This is important to note because if you have smaller children who require car seats, Mirrors does not offer those. At the time of this video, the cost for Mirrors to and from the airport is $16 per person per way, or $13 per child under 9 per way, and children under 3 ride free. Mirrors will usually pick you up about 3 to 3.5 three hours before your flight and will drop you off at whatever terminal you are flying out of. Mirrors can be convenient, however, they will also take the longest of any of your transportation options to Disney. We hope this video has helped you decide if Mirrors is right for your next Disney vacation. Thanks so much for watching and we will see you in the next video!